A Perth toddler has been pecked on the eyelid by a swooping magpie at a trig park known for bird attacks. It's just the latest in a series of spring assaults across the city. But there is a way to check which areas pose the biggest risk. Whether you're riding, jogging or walking, beware of the birds. Magpie nesting season is here, meaning these swooping assassins are on the attack. <coughs> You can't say you're a true Australian, you haven't been swooped by a magpie. Seven-year-old Brendan Gandy knows how dangerous magpies can be. Nipped on the cheek while riding his scooter near Herdsman Lake. He went over my head, just landed it close to me, then got me by the face. His parents thankful it wasn't worse. He got lucky um, only scratching him on the, uh, on the cheek, um, but yeah, you do sort of worry. Um, that they could potentially lose an eye. It's one of two aggressive birds wreaking havoc on Lakeside Road. Brendan's dad wanted to warn others, so logged the attack on the Magpie Alert website. Just put an alert out there just to say, well, potentially this magpie is very territorial and he could potentially injure someone. The page lets you see which parks in your suburb pose the biggest risk and exchange tips on how to stay safe. Clarko Reserve here in Trigger is one of Perth's worst swooping hotspots. Just this week, an 18-month-old toddler was pecked on the eyelid. Last year, two small children were attacked in the same park, prompting the local council to consider a cull. More than 50 attacks have been registered in WA so far this season. Injuries reported at Churchlands, Trigg, Subiaco and Atwell. Swooping season usually lasts from August to November. To avoid injury, steer clear of nesting magpies and protect your eyes. If you're swooped while cycling, get off the bike and walk. Experts say they're less likely to attack if you stay calm and look straight at them. Louise Rennie, Nine News.